Welcome back, everybody, to our next episode of our Thousand Suns Colony. We're working on the spaceship to get our boys off the planet. If they don't die, first to Tyranids or Warp Storms or a Necron Monolith. We'll see. Number days in between purple events. I'm guessing these are all purple events. We could crank, we could lower this number. And eh, maybe we'd leave it. I feel like that's not right. 300 days because we've gotten orc rocks. Like we got this orc rock and then not like just a few episodes ago, we got an orc rock over here. So 300 days between events does not seem correct. Let's make sure we get these guys captured here, folks. Oh, uh, they got it. Maybe not. Where are you going? Where are you going? Arrest this man. Capture that man. Nothing we can do about you, unfortunate. How about you? Yeah, so we can convert you. We got a new space marine. How about this Eldari? Four days. Oh, we can have a demonic party. <clears throat> we should remove unwaveringly loyal. How do you remove it? Do I just cheat? There's no way to without cheating, is there? It's fine, like we don't necessarily necessarily need more people, really. It's just more we have to make more beds on the spaceship. It's Darcy, I keep forgetting we should be converting her on cooldown. Still, still mining that uranium. Don't think we've discovered any new, <clears throat> any new deposits recently. Or steel. We're just waiting for a warp storm to come. Pretty much. I want to see some greater demons. Also get this starship finished. Eh, yeah, three days. Uh, we could probably probably get rid of this Eldar. It's close enough. Yeah, good public execution. Plus six moved. Let's crank up this chem fuel production here. 
We're running out of room in our bridge. I guess I could make more shelves, but I could also just turn this stuff into fuel. We've run out of room in here. This gun's been sitting there for a while. I think we did. Huh. Okay. There we go. A little more room. Oh, they're gonna move these stick bombs out of there. Alright, if we could get a trader ship, please. We can sell all this orc stuff. That would be lovely. That would be very, very good. Excellent. Oh, we need the long range mineral scanner for that. What do we need? Crypto sleep casket. Okay. All right. Escape from this planet, be freedom at last, and maybe return home, but also incredibly dangerous. New ship category is available in the architect menu, blah, blah, blah. Ships require several different parts in order to launch, including a ship reactor. Ship reactors take 15 days to charge up, and many desperate souls want off this planet. Once we begin that process, reactor will emit energy signature, which draws people to the colony. It won't start until you activate your ship's reactor, but when it does, it'll be ferocious. You just stockpile research weapon defenses for the onslaught. Uh, we could put it over here we're gonna move this eventually we need more advanced components i think also uh i guess not plasteel but we do need some more regular steel mind that actually we'll mine this down here It should be interesting if we launch the ship and see, see what comes to attack us it should be very interesting i think penguin ship nah Got the first piece. We're gonna need multiple caskets. Yeah, one computer, one reactor, three engines, and one separate uh, sensor cluster. We need a bunch of caskets, actually. Ah, what's up, Timmy V? Welcome to the stream. working on getting our thousand sons off planet back to Prospero or black back to the eye of terror maybe we should put another research bench could speed things up Comments player. Uh, 
uh, you. Plus some of work stuff. Get rid of these crappy weapons, please. I don't know where these came from. Poor staff, you're gone. Adamantium knife, get out of here. Feeder mandibles, we don't need that. Adamantium demonic plague blade. I didn't even know we had this. Meh. Recurve bow. Bolt guns. 4%. Yeah, get rid of them. I was like, why are they only worth $2.39? Uh, $13 bolt gun. Okay. Oh, pistol hand cannon. Yeah, get rid of these sisters. Bolt guns. Why not? Uh, storm bolter. It's at 35%. We'll get rid of that. We'll get rid of it. Muskets are worth more than bolt guns. Multi launcher. Goodbye. Keep that. I like the anti-material rifle, although we'll probably never use it. Got five of these. We'll keep them. We've got three more. Okay. Sell those five. I'll be able to keep that. Last fusel. Uh, sell the one, I guess. I think we have three of these. Oh, we can finally get rid of all this Imperial Fist armor. Yes. Oh, it's so expensive, too. This guy does not have enough money. Uh, okay. Hmm. Do you have anything worth buying, friend? What is your most expensive thing? Imperial Fist Terminator armor. Alright, uh, we gotta... Not sell some of this armor, I guess. He's not gonna be able to pay us. Unfortunate. Alright, we sold a bunch of weapons, though. So. fun man thanks timmy good finally sell it but yeah unfortunately we can't we can, we can sell one thing of power armor at a time really and even then they're not gonna have enough money we're just gonna clean them out maybe that's what should, maybe that's what we should do i guess <clears throat> or we could just sell it all and they fuck it and get rid of it. I'd rather I'd rather try and maximize our profit though. And I mean we we sold a bunch of crappy weapons that are in here, so it is what it is. Gift it to another faction and sell the remainder? Hmm. Hmm. The problem is these ones are permanently hostile. Like, we can't... I don't think... We can just give them stuff. I mean, we can give them stuff, but it's not going to change their... It's not going to change their um, relations with us. Also, oh, we've got the one animal. We don't really have enough animals to transport. I feel like the armor is very heavy. Now 15 kilograms. Okay. Guess we could have one guy carrying armor each or something.
That wouldn't be that wouldn't be a bad idea. In the future. I kinda wanna hang out because we're gonna get we're gonna get attacked in this episode, I think. I think we're gonna get hit by something. And I hope it's Tyranids or or uh whatchamacallits. Demon Princess. RS Industries. Alright, we got another one. We got another one. No, go there. RS Industries. Uh, do you have anything to buy? Corvus helmet. Hmm. Scout armor, locust armor. Oh, could buy like a locust armor. It's not terrible. I don't think they have any weapons that we want to buy. Oh, what's this? Kill happy, mad muttering. This weapon's persona loves to kill. If this weapon kills someone, its joy will transmit psychically to the wielder, making them happier for days. Mad muttering. This weapon's persona is neurotic and unstable. It mutters mad thoughts to whoever it is bonded with, reducing their mood. I mean, we'll, we'll buy it. They have three of them. Bloodletter Demon Blade. Oxamol Nemesis Falchion. Very cool. Uh, I got some medicine, some components, and I'll sell you. We can sell some armor. There you go. Two pieces of armor. And we got this locust armor for one of our cultists, and this blade, which. Oh, wait, this is different. This is different traits. It says Psychic Fog. This weapon suppresses the wielder's psychic sensitivity by 30%. This only applies while the weapon is held. Jealous. This weapon's persona becomes angry when the bonded individual uses another weapon, thus reducing their mood. Cool. Guess we could have bought all three of them, but... I should have checked, maybe see if they wanted to buy any of this orc stuff. Alright, we got we got rid of some of the armor. Just need a couple more combat suppliers to fly by. Is this almost done? Almost done. Smelt all the orc stuff? You only get the orc components then. And then we're sitting on orc components in our in our inventory. It's just, it's kind of like me. I think we get more money from selling it. Every once in a while, there's a ship that comes by that just wants to work stuff. Uh, okay, we got a bunch of chem fuel. Let's make some more explosive shells, I guess. See if I can't hunt down the other explosive shells. There they are. Okay. Double check all these here. Oh yeah. I'm not even able to tell. I think everything else is good. I think I just missed those couple shelves. 
Okay. I converted the guy. Yeah, the explosives are down there. Excellent. Uh, all right, recruit you. Speaking of conversion. Okay, close to converting Darcy as well. Do we have something in the mechanics? Yeah, we do. We do. But the orc components... I don't know if you can break down... Crypto sleep casket. I don't know if you can break down... The components... I don't know... I get what you're saying. We do... We do have something going on. Extract resources. I get what you're saying. Um, it's at this table. Melt weapon. Yeah, we could do it. Melt weapon, do forever. Smelt apparel, do forever. Clear all. Orc weapons. Okay. Clear all. No work. Um, hmm. All right, maybe not the apparel. Because the apparel all has... It doesn't have the work. Name. Oh, actually, they... They got rid of it all already. I think they just destroyed it. Oh, uh, we get, like, ceremony and stuff. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, we get this... It's and things and components with a K. Oh, good. Solar flare. That's what we need right now. Come on, game. Give us like a warp. Actually, don't give us a warp storm right now. None of our turrets are working. Maybe we should set up some more turrets, huh? Just in case. Something like... Put a few of them over there. Just in case anything comes down, you know, in this area over here. I don't know if we can fit any more over here. I guess we could. It's like we're playing a real-time strategy game. Oh, we need more steel <clears throat> in order to do that. I'm going to give Blackheart a new... Bolter. Oh, I like this. This is the piercing one you're saying. I like the Soul Reaper cannon, though. This one, Cave cave Ants. We could switch. Um, I have to make them. This Inferno Bolter. Look at all the things we can make. Oh, look, we can make the... These are like the weapons that have um, the special things, which we call it. The bonded weapons. We can make this 80 and 4. Yeah, we can make those. Which cave ons? I think... Yeah. We can keep black hearts until we get... Not that. Okay, that's broken. Until we get this. Then we can give him this. The relic. I'm fine with that. Uh, we need to mine... some more steel. 
Just mine this whole chunk out. And we can mine this whole thing out here. And there's a little bit more over here. The more Terminator armor? We could, we could. I got, we gotta see how many advanced components. We gotta wait. See how many advanced components we need. For the, uh, for the spaceship. And Plasteel as well. Caravacult Sorcerer Armor. Oh wait, is this Terminator? It is. Oh, cool. <clears throat> yeah, because this requires 15 advanced components, 230 Plasteel. It's a lot. We only have 15 advanced components. <laughs> I mean, we can, we can make more, but. Yeah, that's all missing steel. We should cover this wire, though. I mean, if something does come over here, it destroys the wire, then... I wish it connected up there, actually. Space drone hack. Boom. Drop it on us. Looking all the way over here. All right. That's a ways. We'll wait till it gets close to the raid, and then we'll send people over there. That's not worth like sending one person at a time. Yeah, um, maybe. Uh, let's see. Zooming. Yeah, go hack. Get some of it done. We can always fly this person. We can always fly our demon prince over there. Actually, we're gonna... We're gonna get the boys ready here. Raid's gonna be arriving soon. Cancel the sermon. I can't manually cancel it. You being here is a little scary. Depends on what angle they come from. Oh boy. Uh, I mean, I guess we can, we can take it. We can take it. Uh, yeah, you there, you up there, you get over here. You get over there. A lot of them are melee. I think we're fine. Also, they're lining themselves up, so the piercing, the piercing bolt guns are very good here. Excellent work, man. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh. Uh-oh. A monolith is a massive mobile fortress used by the Necrons as their primary planetary assault craft. A monolith combines the properties of a transport craft, honored armored destroyer, and icon of undying Necron powers. Ponderous form can float 
across the battlefield upon its anti-gravitic engines. Also, its crystal core pulsates with uh, sickly energy that can be manipulated into powerful beams of Gauss lightning, which whip out from its weapon mounts. When its massive silhouette looms over a battlefield, it will lay waste to entire armies with strobing torrents of Gauss fire and the deafening crack of its particle whips. Few armies can stand long before the immense firepower of a monolith. Living troops are reduced to their component atoms by its punishing gut. Okay, okay, let's... Hey, man. I can't even target it. Oh. Okay. You move? Oh, that's a big circle. Uh, okay. Man the mortar, my friend. And fire on this thing. It only has a thousand HP. It's pulsing. His radius is scary. If anybody wanders into here, they're gonna die. Also, I forgot we should finish these people off before they wake up. And take the skulls of our enemies. Uh, okay. I thought there were more bodies. Where you at, buddy? Alright, here we go. You missed. Motherfucker. Hit it. Affecting gender male. Oh, psychic suppression. Get everyone inside? I don't think he can move. Okay, why are we going 1x speed? I forgot this was going to happen again. Shit. Uh, that's not good. I wasn't ready. Uh, well, they're not going to get there in time. You can. Oh, you can't. Really? All right, well, I can manually. Oh, Kaylee. Uh, we're gonna have to have you guys fall back, actually. Move back away. We're gonna have to abandon this, I think. Until we get reinforcements. You come up here. Do you have any weapons? You don't. You come back home. You have no business being there. Uh, I'm afraid they're gonna destroy the thing. Well, maybe not. Uh, maybe. Oh, that's a big explosion. thing's done for. <laughs> no way it's surviving. Just the fire. Uh unfortunate. Uh, maybe? Not in home area. Fuck, fuck, fuck. This is stupid. 
Okay. English. I think this is a futile effort, maybe. Can you? No. God damn it. Well, we got a monolith to deal with. We'll get more, uh... We have more things in the future. You. Back on the mortar. How we doing here? We haven't hit it once. How many shells did you waste? Uh, I don't know, not that many. Keeps missing. All right, get off the mortar. I need something. Oh, fuck. Oh, I didn't know that happened. Oh. Cool. We got an immortal. Oh, these are different than the ones that you can play as. Okay, we got a shit ton of warriors. There's a destroyer, a heavy destroyer in here. Is that the immortal? Yeah, it is. That's why I said get everyone inside. All right, fair enough, fair enough. Blade one. I had never seen these before. Uh, you, my friend, need to get inside. Okay. You're carrying somebody back. Uh, you will not. A couple of wraiths here, too. A couple of scarabs. All right, everybody up. And ringer. Please pay attention. Please. 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 Please stop your. Ah, oh, you fucker. Okay, well, he's probably dead. Unfortunately. All right, let's see how this goes. Easy. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, they got the the gauss weapons are are scary. So far so good. Actually, we We handled that very well. Oh, actually, we want Lauren Hobo to, to get that. <clears throat> uh, yeah, let's finish you guys off. And we can shred these guys, I think, for some material. Oh, my God. Okay, we didn't need that to happen right then and there, guys. Okay. Where are you guys going? Extracting skulls. Where are you? Who's on their feet? Okay. Yes. They can revive themselves? Yeah. Even when they're dead dead? Or when they're downed? Well, we'll keep, we'll keep an eye on, keep an eye on the situation here. The turrets are handling things. 
so far. Okay. So I need to see... Okay, range-wise... Let's get you... Let's get you over here. No. Let's get you right outside the range. I think he can hit... The monolith and be out of range. So we want to be right there. Yes. Easy. Easy peasy. Holy shit. Awesome. That was cool. Feeling depressed. Look at all this steel, man. You just soloed a uh, Necron monolith. You should not feel depressed. Also convert this lady. Congrats, you converted her. And you've finished finish these off. Okay, so now we have to make a bill that shreds them, right? Where is that? Shred mechanoid? Yes. All right, so yeah, we need we need someone to be doing that. Shred these guys quickly. Cool. Oh, we get plasteel and components. Oh, we don't even get like necrodermis. Interesting. have a mental breakdown uh you unassigned to smithing race of bleak porcupine who are you i don't even know who you are man not gonna lie all right lauren hobo i'm gonna put you at four just because you weren't supposed to be our crafter and i cheated and boosted your crafting skill so got two more bodies left cool that was awesome damn I wonder what I wonder what like your colony wealth has to be to actually well, I guess it doesn't matter it's just a very small percentage chance for the monolith to spawn and then colony wealth will determine uh, like how many Necrons come out from the thing, right? That didn't seem too bad. I just didn't realize they were gonna they were gonna come out. And I guess we could have left the if we had left the monolith, right? There would have just been more that, that kept coming. Very cool, very cool. Alright. Yeah, get more turrets set up, please. We got all the steel in the world right now. Excellent. All right. Let's do the outro for the video, guys. This is Monday, I think. Thank you for watching. If you're watching on Monday, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave your comments down below. Make sure to join me for the live streams Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays. And then, uh, yeah, next episode will be out tomorrow. Same time, same place. You can find a link to the mod pack in the description of this video down below as well if you have any issues setting that up feel free to contact me in the comments or uh on discord festival to zinch we can do a festival for the folks we can do a festival for the boys it's been a while all right love you all thank you for watching stream hang out we're not done we're gonna keep going 
Uh, but I'm gonna, you know, get up and stretch my legs and go to the bathroom and stuff. So I'll be back in a few minutes. Love you all. I will see you all very, very soon.